Hi everyone, this is Intang Mayumi. I have a video for you today. This stamp set is by uh, Sugar P Design and it's called the uh, Caffeine Addict. And um, I stamped the cup image uh, using Versafine Onyx Black Ink. And over here, I'm showing that the stamp set that I have is defective. So I uh, messaged them and they sent me new one and um, I'm really happy that I got a new and not defective stamp set so uh, over here I'm showing you that I'm uh, filling up those ones that I'm it's not stamping good using a sharpie pen I use distress inks to color the cup but first I'm going to emboss the um, image with clear embossing powder and um, hit it with my heat tool. The distress inks I use are Mermaid Lagoon, Dusty Concord, and Pink Raspberry. As you can see, I'm putting some water on the cup first before I'm going to color it. I mix uh, Dusty Concord and Pink Raspberry distress ink to get uh, the color that I wanted. I start coloring from the bottom and then just let the color move. I add Mermaid Lagoon um, in the middle of the cup and let it set there. For the froth, I use Aliens Glitter Snow and apply the Glitter Snow until it is all covered with a dry brush. I have this glitter in mustache and it is the same color as the cup. I use groupings of glitter on the froth using tweezer. Um, you can use your finger but I don't want to sprinkle them on the froth. And then I also put just a little color using the same color as the cup. I then fussy cut the image. Um, I think this is stamp set. Uh, has coordinating dies, but I don't have it, so I just use my scissor to cut it. Using Memento Tuxedo Black marker, I color the edges so the white on the edges are not showing. This stitch rectangle die set is from Gina Marie Designs. I also use the 6x6 paper pad and it is called the B-side from Basic Gray. And also the stencil splatters uh, from Tim Holtz. I use pink raspberry first on the um, stencil and then cleaning uh, the stencil in between and then I'm gonna use uh, mustard seed next. There's also a couple of this uh, coffee stains from the stamp set and uh, just use that on the card also. Sentiments I use is from Fiskars and it says your, your kindness warms my heart. And the sentiment didn't stamp good so I'm just using my sharpie marker to uh, fix that. I use foam adhesive on the back of the coffee cup. After I attach the copy cup on the panel, I use my Spectrum Noir Sparkle Pen to color the cup to give it a shimmer. I stamp the logo from the stamp set that says Caffeine Addict and uh, emboss it with clear embossing powder and also fussy cut it. And then I also, I'm also going to use... Um, the Memento Tuxedo Black Marker to color the edges. And I use Tombow Liquid Glue to attach it on the cup and also on the panel. 
and now I'm going to score my card base and it's going to be um, A2 size card. And finally, I'm going to attach the whole panel on the A2 size card base. And for the inside of the card, I use this hard coffee beans from the set and I did a uh, second generation stamping. As always, thank you for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.